PS. I don't even know what PS stands for, but just the PS. I'm actually obviously outside and I'm a bit scared. There's people staring at me, but whatever. I don't know you, you don't know me. Hardy, shush. Okay, here comes the that keeps that keeps staring at me, so we're glad that he's moving. We'll just wait, hold on. H squad welcome back to my channel if you're new to this channel hello I am Harley today I'll be doing a Q&A video I did post on my Instagram to ask you guys if you guys wanted a playlist video or a Q&A video this week and you guys chose a Q&A video if you haven't already subscribe comment like this video it really does support my channel so thank you very much let's pull up the question shut up Number one, do you have any regrets? Regret. <laughs> and can you tell I'm nervous? Do you have any regrets with high school and do you miss it? I wouldn't say they're regrets. I do take back a lot of the things that I did do. Wait, wait, that is a regret. I don't regret anything to be honest. Any decision I made, no. I don't regret not doing ATAR. And do I miss high school? I really do miss high school. I feel like stepping into the adult life, I got a taste of it and I wanted to go right back. <laughs> the best location anywhere in the world you recommend for a best friend getaway. If you don't know me already, I love traveling. And one place that I have been that I think should be done if you love adventure is Canada. Like one of my favorite, favorite trips with my best friend. So I'll show you some pictures. As you can see in pictures. Yeah, I had the best time. I do have a vlogging channel. Channel, channel, channel. I do have a vlogging channel with all my Canada vlogs. I actually still have more to edit. If you love thrill and adventure, I definitely recommend Canada, but on the Rocky Mountain side, cause like me and my best friend had the best time. Miss you. What have you been doing with your life since high school? I miss you too, Gianna. I basically went straight to work. During my HSC, I worked at a gym for about two years and I am so sorry if my exposure is really a lot because the sun is out today and it doesn't want to go away. Within that time, I did my personal training course, so my Cert 3, my Cert 4 of personal training. So yes, I am a qualified personal trainer. <laughs> right now, I am currently studying community services, so helping out with the community. So right now, I actually am working as a support worker to help um, people that are in need, um, especially people that are older. It's really fun for me, because I'm a very people person. You know, I like talking. I don't shut up. Next question. Who's your favorite music artist to listen to? Ooh, oh my gosh, this is without a doubt. This person has not disappointed. This person, Blast. Oh my gosh. You know what, let me just play a song for you. Oh. Hello. I'll, I'll play my favorite song from this person. I like this so fast. Some things you won't understand. Take this, take trips out. Next question. What is keeping you sane during lockdown? Ah, if you have not been updated or you live under a rock and don't know that half of Australia is in lockdown, you definitely live under a rock. Puzzles. Call me a grandma. I don't give a but puzzles are on oh, a whole nother level for me. It really like, move out the way. I've done three since lockdown. Do you, whoa, do you miss me? No, <laughs> I'm kidding. I miss you, Maya. Need a workout vid from you, sis, so I can be ripped like you. Well, my darling, it's definitely coming soon. I haven't figured out my own personal workout routine because I'm very on and off, especially during this lockdown. I don't want to make that an excuse, but it's my, it's my excuse. But I haven't done weight training in a while because obviously gyms are closed and I'm just waiting for my man's gym equipment to come because he's got his own home gym and stuff. Okay, I'm rambling on, sorry. I'm sorry. This person went hard out with the question, so we're just gonna answer them real quick. What is one thing you know you want from life? Yeah, shit. Success. My age and my height, I am 20 years old and I am, oh, oh, 
it feels so weird saying that because the last time I did the q and I was only like a fresh baby like I was like 18 17 but now I'm 20. What is my height? I'm 168 centimeters. So you do the math, cause I don't know the math. <laughs> Biggest regrets. I regret not continuing with YouTube consistently. Are your feet ticklish? Okay, that's a really weird question to ask, but yes. Why do you wanna know? Favorite heels. I only wear heels like when I go out or sometimes, but like it's not enough for me to know like, I love the stiletto. Oh. What's the most embarrassing thing that you've ever been through? Sir Khan, why? Why are you trying to embarrass me? You just wanna expose me to the world, okay. Uh, uh, why do you want me to relive this moment, Sir Khan? Please tell me. I used to live in a different state and we were having like an awards ceremony and I was like in year two, three, Obviously, they call out the name. So how our award system worked was we would all be in like this little Ashfelt kind of thing. You know, they have their little presenters, and then they say the name. This person won the award. Da da da. Please tell me why. As you know, my name's Harley. This person's name was Carly, and I got up and went to the stage, and it wasn't for me. In front of like my whole year group. Hands down, embarrassment. It was the walk back for me. I was so devastated. Cause everyone, all eyes on me. It's just like the walk of shame. You're just walking and just like. And you know the eyes are on you. You can feel the eyes on you. Cause you're like, idiot. What an idiot. Got up and their name's not even Carly. What does happiness look like to you? My family and my partner's family. Oh, and my partner. My partner's family is my family too, so. Where do you want to travel to and do you miss me? <laughs> oh my gosh, do I miss you, Miss Ivana. Definitely, definitely, definitely. When these borders open, ah, I'll be out. Out! I think the next place I'm going to will be... I feel like it'll be another American state. Do you have a certain philosophy you live by? My own philosophy that I've always said at the end of my videos, stay true to yourself, never settle for negativity. I really do feel like I live by that. When's your birthday? 4th of February, 2001. Aquarius, baby. I am a snake in the Chinese, I don't know what it's called. The Chinese, the Chinese, you know, horoscope kind of thing. What are your education goals? I am like a jellyfish. Like I kind of test the waters in different areas of maybe heading towards teaching. <sighs> Ooh. Ooh. I, if 2015 year old Harley would have seen this video, seen me say that I want to be a teacher, uh, I would have thought I was lying because back in the day I was like, I hate kids. Nah, no way am I going to be a teacher to deal with that. Mm -mm. Who knows? Who knows? I might be something totally different. I might be an astronaut. How are you, baby spice? Ooh. I'm just okay. We're just living day to day. Next question, I really don't want to answer, but I'm going to put it there because I said I was going to put it there. And it's from my brother. Curiously inquiring about why is it so that you were so gay for? I feel like there was too much in that question. Ugh. Oops. What has been a highlight for you in 2021? Highlight has definitely. Ooh. Oh, hold on. Let me just look at my calculator. Bruh. <laughs> Let me just look at my camera roll. Definitely not lockdown. Definitely been going to new places with my partner. So I'm just gonna insert some pictures here. We actually made a list of like how much we've done since being together for like three years. We realized that we didn't actually do a lot. So we made a decision to just go out all the time and we did so much. And another highlight of my year was definitely the birth of my little brother, Hendrix. What is your workout schedule? So yeah, as I was saying before, um, I will 
definitely be making some workout videos. What are your goals for the next five years? One that I can think of is definitely buying an investment property. I definitely want to travel within the next five years. Each year, I definitely want to go to a di different place. Next question. Do you intend to make YouTube a full-time thing or just something to have fun with? I definitely do want to make this a full-time thing. That's all the questions for today. Thank you guys so much for participating. If you haven't already, like this video, comment anything you'd like, share and subscribe. It really does support my channel. If you guys have any video requests, please put it in the video. In the video. Put it in the comments down below and I can definitely look into doing them. Yeah. At the end of every video, I always say, please remember to stay true to yourself. Never settle for negativity because that's just a waste of time, fam. You go. See you.